Since launching Rooms on the App Store five months ago, we've seen over 250,000 registered users make hundreds of thousands of rooms. There are games, art pieces, recreations of real-world places, and tons of weird and wonderful experiments. But our initial app design didn't account for this many rooms, and so we realized we needed to make them easier to discover. Enter Rooms 2.0. Starting with the home screen, you can now browse by category. So if you want to see all the rooms that are games, you can do that. You can now browse your home feeds in an entirely new way with the honeycomb view. We've added an explore page for even more ways to find new rooms. From here, you can see the top trending rooms by category, browse current and past challenges, and more. We now have the create button front and center for easy access. And it's now just one tap to start a room with no walls or no floor. Finally, we added an activity tab so you can keep track of interactions with your rooms and know when things you've created have been added to other people's rooms. As before, this all works on iPad and continues to be completely free. If you'd like to try it, go to rooms.xyz or search rooms on the App Store.